thought I had given my life to Jesus um, because I prayed a prayer. And then as I've gotten older, I'm like, yeah, I don't think I didn't notice any life change at all. And it was my freshman year of college. I went to USI and my best friend is a year older than me. So she attended a campus ministry there. Uh, I attended there for my freshman and sophomore year, still in the same scenario, like, yep, I know all the stories. I believe that Jesus is God, but my life was not any different than just like, yep, I'm going to go to heaven when I die. There at the campus ministry and meeting a lot of my best friend, Kaylee, a lot of her friends, um, they were talking about Jesus just in regular conversation. Yeah, seeing people my age that were following Jesus, that they talked about Jesus like he was real to them. And I realized at that time, like, I actually, I'm not following Jesus. Um, and my campus minister was a pretty blunt guy, like wonderful, love him so much. And that's what I needed. I needed to hear like, if your life has not changed, then you're not actually following Jesus. And I needed to hear that. So for, for two years, my freshman and sophomore years, um, I prayed kind of selfishly, but the Lord used it. I prayed, God, help me want to want you because I don't. But I want what those people have. And I know that it's you because they talk about Jesus. Um, so I, it was just an honest, very simple prayer. I can't tell you guys how many times I prayed, God help me want to want you because I don't. But he is sovereign and he is good and he is kind and he answered that prayer.